Hey guys, how are you going? And oh, welcome back to another episode of this Cricket 22 career mode. In today's episode, once again, playing another first class match. We're playing Hampshire here, who are currently in last place. They have yet to win a game. Glamorgan have won all three. Once again, still very close to the Australian side. So hopefully we uh, get a call up soon. Uh, we are playing at uh, Sophia Gardens. Uh, yeah, controversial take on that... Uh, on the stadium name but there we go let's play and here we are welcome back welcome back to the fortress have uh you to lose a game we've gone unchanged hampshire kyle abbott decent bowler interesting let's go down to the toss um it's once again it's a soft uh soft standard pitch i think so potential potential uh potential to fuck it and have a bat first and here we go 29 matches Average of 60, and we are 5 for 1 for 6. We're betting with Marn. First time betting with uh, Marn for Glamorgan. So that's nice. Solid. No run there. 5 for 1 for 6. Not a crack. Not a great start. Uh, had better. But Marn's 39 of 66. Hopefully we can stay out with him as Wheel is charging in here. 1 for 22. Driven. Oh, no run there. Although. No overthrows there. Really hoping that the Ashes uh, is in England this time around because we might be a sneaky chance. <laughs> Holy shit! Oh, <laughs> I've never seen all three stumps out of the ground. <laughs> oh wow! I'm not even mad. That is just unbelievable. I can't quite believe that. I am. Uh, I'm amazed. Middle. Uh, <laughs> Middle and off, both out the ground, and then let's just take a look at the actual stumps here. Okay, so the other one, leg stump is in out the ground, based off one of the other poles, just fucking dismantling us. It's like an explosion went off. All three just flying. What a picture. That's actually sick. <laughs> that actually looks... <laughs> look at where all... <laughs> Look at where the stumps are. Covered some serious ground. That's um, that's just impressive. It is just really impressive. Well, well, well. That was eventful. 85 wickets at 32, though. We are getting a chance with the ball. We made 193 all out. Marnus top scoring with 50. Wow. Crane took six for. Can't believe that. It's not. I'm not even mad at it. I mean, a lot of you. A lot of you guys are not uh, happy with the lack of runs being scored, and that's okay because I've put it up to hardest. But that wicket there was worth it. Uh, the price alone, really. Anyway, first ball, 2 for 64 off 20 overs Hampshire. Wait. Jeez, it's been crunched to gully. We normally run this field. It's worked uh, not last game, but in the last couple of games, it's worked very well. But last game, bloody Cole Cadmore teed off. Okay, that was a very terrible walk. Shouldn't have gone that straight, especially with no one there. Keep had to run after it. So that's on me, apologies. Sort of rattled after that wicket still. Yep. Um, that's just uh, unlucky. T Albert, don't know who he is, but he's scoring rounds at a quick rate. I mean, he's just taking us for eight. And leaves that one. Well, it looks like we will get another chance to bat, which is good. We've got uh, we need to redeem ourselves after that uh, wicket. And but hopefully we can take a few poles here. We do take stacks of poles here at Sophia Gardens. Um, but I mean, can we get them here? Driven, no run. End of the over. Eight off. Please don't go for overthrows. Good. Last ball of the over. It's been a lot better. No runs conceded just yet. Although it is the last ball. Get it. Get up. Uh, but on your bike, mate. Something had to happen. And thankfully for us, it was a wicket. And uh, we picked up our first of the match. And that is old T. Albert of the Toby variety. He departs for 42. Into our third over here. Holland is... Facing. Oh wow. I'm pretty sure if it's the same Holland I'm thinking of. He's playing isn't he trying to or was he playing for USA or trying to apply to play for USA or something? Not sure. That's what I thought. Oh wow. He just ran and stopped. 
That's a interesting move from the cover. Yep. Shot. Not bad from holding that time. It's going to go for another boundary. One for 16. All four scoring shots. Just been boundaries. Um, so that's disappointing. Four ball. Every over. This is going to hurt. But it's happened here. Uh, so we've got him out. We're batting again. Average has dipped under 30. Jeez. I've lost since that's happened. Uh, they were 2 3 9 all out. I just pressed square and I just did like some through and it just kept on going. It's like, yeah, sure. So we only bought the five overs. One for 16. Solder took three for 86. He got pumped though. Um, minus one foot, nice, and he's scored a ton now 106 of 172. He's having a great game. We've got Crane bowling though, he is uh, two for 56. No run. So we've got a lead of 198. We need to get that up to at least 300, I reckon, to have a good chance. We've got Kyle Abbott having a trundle, and uh, that is well played. Of course, we are on up here. Hopefully, uh, we don't get one, obviously. But we also need to get that average above 60 again. So we need a cheeky little, I don't know, 145 not out. That'd be lovely. Mine's though. Seen him pretty well, looks like. No run. Shot. Finally. Off the pair. And it's going to be a lovely shot for four. That's the shot we needed to kickstart our innings. Last ball coming up here. Have it bowling gas. Is that in the gap again? It is. Three extra cover this time. Short boundary straight. It's a fire in gardens. And uh, look, we're going to scamper for... Oh, direct hit. We're gone. <sighs> that was risky. Good sweep. Go the ball. Two. Not bad. Not bad at all. Moving on to nine. Four. Holy shit. Right of the screws of that one. That's gone to the fence. So another boundary, moving on to 13 here. I only scored the one half century. That was last game, I believe. So hopefully we can continue this form, which uh, it's not really form. Start of a new day, Marnus walks out, averaging 45. Where's what, 58, 59? Another spinner, organ. Interesting. What are we, five for two, six, seven. Crane, got spin from both ends to begin the day. And it's a lovely cut shot. First shot of the day. Risky going on the back dog, but effective and two more. It's also day three as well, so the match uh, interestingly poised, I would say. Um, I mean, we have got a decent lead at the moment. 2-2-3. Two, two, what did they make in their first innings? 2-3-9. So, I don't know. Interesting. If we could get a few more, like, oh, if we could get, if we could get 300 uh, in the next couple of sessions, like a 300 run lead, then I reckon that'll be enough. But just got to make sure we just keep batting with Marn. Oi! That cut is on as well. There's a big gap there. There we go. What a cut shot. Hadn't really been playing it uh, at all until just recently, and it's actually working out really well. I was just always worried going on the back foot that uh, the timing wouldn't be there and it would schnick off. But a couple shots here have uh, shown otherwise that it's quite a good shot. We're moving on to 19. Waiting. No run there. That's the end of the 70th over. Wait. Yep. Shot straight down the ground. Won't go the distance. I think we'll actually just set up for one. Four. Just waited on the poor, poor ball. It wasn't even that bad a ball. Sort of played on the up. That's another boundary though. Oh, what? We do love that shot here. And uh, moving on to 28 now. Lead around 240 or 243. Not bad, not bad. And we can choose to declare, but I won't be doing that. We've still got, I mean, we've just started day three. So there's so much time left. That is a great diving save. And it's also a big if if we don't lose all our wickets. So hopefully we don't. More uh, or organ bowling, sorry. Wow, that has moved quite a bit. What a nut. And yep. I just like talking about stuff that I hope would happen. And a couple of years later, it just doesn't work out for me. It just happens all the time. And uh, I'm not surprised. He did look threatening there. Well, that ball before, and we just went for a fish outside off and uh, schnicked off. 
Depart for 29 or 37. Now we will bet all the way through, I reckon. Okay. Interesting. I think they've got, what do we get? 363, Aman 139 all out. Uh, 139 out. Uh, everyone sort of chipped in. 1 for 23 at the moment. They need 294 more runs. It is day three. It's lunch? Not even lunch, is it? I don't know. I've, uh, Look, we're gonna we're gonna start bowling here. 86 at 32. I reckon. Uh, look, it's a strong possibility that we take poles quickly. Hopefully, 318 though. Can't see them chasing it. Although it's just another jinx that I've cooked myself with, so that's nice. No run there. Last ball of our first over coming up. So usually uh, four or a wicket. And a wicket. Thank you. It's another inside edge through to the keeper Horton who takes a lot of catches off our bowling. Probably what, 70%, 70-80%. Press departs for 11, 2 for 26. It's a good start as Albert makes his way up to the crease. We've got him out last uh, innings. So hopefully we can do the same again. This is going to be his first ball. So we're going to be bowling pretty much a similar delivery that we did to Prest. Can we get another edge? Oh, back foot first ball. I don't mind that at all. Catch it! No! Uh, it's annoying, that's going to be four. Yep. Far out, what a shot! Bit the cordon, that's a cracking shot. Oh, there we go. Finally, a bit of aggression this time, it's from Holland, who launches into that one. It's a one bounce four. I was waiting for that. Last ball coming up now, one for 15. Last ball of the eighth over. Probably will just leave this one now, he's already got his boundary. No! One hit it again and almost snicked off. What are you doing? He's gone now though. Albert, uh, well, Organist joined Albert at the crease. Will any of them try to go expansive? I mean, Organ got us out last uh, inning, so we're looking for a bit of revenge there. But uh, we've made the breakthrough, well, someone has, which is good. As well, left, 148k's, but down on pace here. Oh, it's another shot through the gap. It's starting to get a few more runs here, so we're going to race to the fence for another boundary. Got him. Oh, it's stiff, mate. Went for the expansive drive. Inside edge onto the stumps. We've seen it before. Oh, it's really stiff. Just hits the leg stump and the bow goes off. Toby Albert got him twice in the same game. Departs for 33. 4 for 87 is Gubbins. Makes his way out to the crease. A little lefty. And uh, both bats are yet to score a run. This is extremely good for the uh, Glamorgans. Oh, played the wrong line of it, just did it too much. Yep. Fuck, it's a cracking shot from Organ. A little late cut, that should go for four. Another from his partnership starting to develop here. 27 for Gubbins, 24 for Organ. And they both are uh, at the crease, they both started off uh, with zero, so his partnership's around 50. So we need a break at 4 for 139, chasing 318. Still a long way to go. Can we snag this wicket, break this partnership? Start off with a couple of nice uh, deliveries. Yep. Wow, that's fucked. Thought I was well outside off there, but no, the jag jagged a lot. Went for four. That's just a terrible ball from me. Do I have to start thinking about do I need to bring on bring in people on the leg side or is it just don't bowl straight, you muppet? Catch! Jeez, that was uppish. Oh, fuck me. That is bullshit bowling. What am I doing? I'm really ruining the figures here. 8 off, 2 for 32. Fuck, it's yuck. Oh, and it's 4 2. Jesus, Gubbins has just fucking smashed me. Change your feet up slightly just for Gubbins. Actually, I think for maybe both, but oh well. Let's give it a go. There's a man there, but it could be. Oh, no way. No way, what a fielding placement. What captaincy. Didn't have any men out in the first innings or up until now. First ball, we've changed the field, we've put a man out. Tries to take it on for some reason, and I actually thought he got a lot more uh, than he did. But he's holed out at uh, long off. Man, he would love that. The Australian connection. Governs the parts of 40, fell into the trap. Absolute Muppet areas. Also up with a new bat. I can pull the weakest skill. I do have a man out there, so let's actually give him a bumper first ball. Yep. And that's four. Yep, well, you know, 
So much for being a weaker skill, mate. Three for 40, though. Five for 157. We made the breakthrough. Sensational stuff. Do I keep this field, though? Probably shouldn't, although it is organ. Oh, it was organ anyway. I thought I was buying to all sop. That's silly from me. Anyway. Well, left. Lost ball of the over. It's been a successful one. Can we make it a double? Yep. It's an edge. It wouldn't have carried anyway. And they... Why are the field has just stopped running? What? Are they just wanting to have a race? Fucking weird stuff, man. Yep. Four. It's gone over cover there. Good shot. Bowling to Allsop for the first time. Going back to the aggressive field because his weakest skill is the, is the drive. So uh, we're a huge chance here. Last ball of the over. He's been driving every single one. I reckon we're a chance here for an edge. Last ball. No. Every shot he's played, been a drive, but he's absolutely been smashing it. Yes. Shot. Fuck. No foot movement, but who needs that when you've got great hand eye? Yes. Shot. Fuck. Another good shot for four. Last ball of the other, something's going to happen here. With three for 57, not, uh, about to be 18. Yep. Fuck. Jeez, he loves the cut. We're back. 18 overs, 5 maidens, 3 for 61. And uh, Hampshire, 9 for 227. What the shit? Kerry and Richardson have been smashing them. Organ is the only bloke. We're still out there. 65. Jeez. Bit of a uh, collapse on the cards. We are bowling to Organ. No run there. So they still need just under 100 now. And we only need one wicket. So it's looking good for the Glamorgans. Can we get the job done and remain unbeaten in this uh, county championship? Good around them. Glamorgan once again. Another win. Four in a row. Won by 62 runs. Play of the match. Looks like it's mine, of course. He deserves it. And uh, 50 off 87 in the first dig, followed by 139. Absolutely sensational stuff. Uh, we went all right. Not with a bat, really. Three ball dark in the first. That was unreal scenes. And then uh, in the next one, we uh, well, we bowled. We went all right. We got uh, one for 16 of five. But, uh, I mean, we could have been. We didn't bowl a whole lot of overs, unfortunately. And then uh, we had another bat, 29 of 37 out to Organ. And then 255 all out for Hampshire. Organ finishes 92 not. We pick up three for 67 off 21. Richardson the destroyer, four for 44. And that's four wins in a row. So, unfortunately, no more Australian selection this time round. Still waiting, we're still very close. When's the next tour happening? Uh, of course, we sit on top of the table. Four wins out of four, 88 points. Love to see that. Uh, if we'll have a look and see the play of the series stuff. Bess on top, uh, tight of Crane. Dell's got the most runs. Uh, Cole Cadmore in second. Bess has take, taken 36 poles. Can't see any Glamorgans apart from Horton, who's taken the most catches, which is not surprising. Let's take a look at uh, the bank stats, won't be great. The bowling, we're not in the top half anymore. We have 16 wickets at 14.25. I'll take that any day of the week. But uh, anyway, that will be it for today's episode. Thank you so much for watching. If you enjoyed today's episode, please leave a like and subscribe. If you're feeling up to it, leave a comment down below. Always appreciating those. But uh, until then, take it easy.